Z's are placed inside the jar and the lid is then sealed. They are left undisturbed for three days. Then, when the jar is opened, the fleas will not jump out. In fact, the fleas will never jump higher than the level set by the lid. Their behavior is now set for the rest of their lives. And when these fleas reproduce, their offspring will automatically follow. All right, Shalom, Akim, Shalom. Hey, Yah Bashimal Shai Barak Atham. Our praises to Yah Abba Bashimal Shai and Devon State Elder Apostles of the Great Millstone. All right, welcome back to another GMS Inspiration of the Almighty. And um, as you can see, the title: Peep this flea experiment and thank the Lord for His mercy. Peep this flea experiment and thank Yah Abba Bashimal Shai for His mercy. And um, as you can see, I just put that clip in the beginning uh, of this lesson. I have found that clip and it tripped me out. Now, you know, the scriptures say that, uh, you know, Esau's, he search, his, his search is diligent. You know what I'm saying? This dude, this dude really takes his time out to study all, everything. You know, every heart, every one of the heart of them is deep, in other words. And... You see that they, they literally put fleas in a little container and left it undisturbed for three days. And then it made the fleas, when they took the lid off of the container, it made the fleas never jump out of the container. You know? And the dude says that these their, their, their lifestyle is set for life. And I was just tripping because... This this Edomite, this self proclaimed white man, he has did that to the to the people. He have, he has took his data he collected from that experiment on fleas and basically uh, practiced it practiced it on the people because these people they have they have individual invisible boundaries that Esau put on their minds to think the way that they think. And, and I'm like, damn, these, these people are a bunch of fleas. And then it, it led me to, man, all praises to Yahweh Shemel Shai for setting me free. Just as our Lord and Savior Yahweh Shai said it in John 8 and 32. You should know the truth, and the truth truth to set you free. So we, we're, we're mentally freed from the, the invisible boundaries that Esau put on the mind of these people. You think y'all about Shemel Shah for that because before understanding the truth, you were like the flea. You were either caught in a lifestyle of shit, gang banging, chasing women, being a whore. You know what I'm saying? Uh, just trying to go to school, make a career, and not really uh, be an honorable and integral person. It, it's like you, you're, if you don't, if the Lord don't set you free from. The way of this world, you you just caught right in it. You got you got now. You have a lot of the uh, old school trying to act young. You can look at their haircuts that they walking around with. You got an old school man dressing young with a haircut like like one of these new little new age rappers, man. <laughs> it's terrible because they trying to keep up with the Joneses. They trying to um. Really, it just going back to that experiment. They're, they they have been set with invisible boundaries, and Esau has did all the programming. It starts when we were uh, it started when we were children. For the moment that you, for the moment you start your school system, you're putting that uh, that uh, that invisible boundary, you know, situation to where you you uh. Your mind is formed to society. It's, it's fucking, it's, it's terrible, man. It's terrible. But see, like like that, going back to that, to the fleas in the, in the container, it's like uh, the Lord spiritually let us jump out. <laughs> we jumped out. We jumped out. We was like, hold up real quick. Hey, y'all, we, we, we jumped out of the, the container and we looking at the container and we telling 
the other Israelites, hey man, you could jump out. The lid is open. The truth is out here. This is the truth. You could jump out of there. All you gotta do is just jump a little higher. You'll come right out if the lid is off. But what what does the people do? They're 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 like the Esau said in that experiment, their mind is is set for life. They telling us, nah, man, we ain't the Israelites. They telling us that we crazy. You know what I'm saying? We're hateful. You know what I mean? Jake coming completely against what the truth say. Completely against it. Because their Esau has set invisible boundaries to them and they can't see them and they don't they don't believe that they're there. You know? You know what I'm saying? And the Lord has had heavy mercy to be able to to, to, to allow us to escape these individual visible boundaries. Because we're the if it's invisible, where the hell do you start at? You know what I'm saying? Well, shit, hey, you started the spirit and power. You started repenting to your Havabah Shemel Shai and uh, start start worshiping the spirit of the Heavenly Father, man. And then you you start to see that this shit is all an experiment. Literally, this this world, this life is a damn a big ass experiment. It's an experiment of Esau Edom, and he got he got it he got it exactly how. He wants it. Look at it. I'm rolling past all these damn people. Here it is. They go to work every goddamn day and, don't, and, and just for years doing the same shit. Doing the same shit. Commuting to work. Dealing with the damn the ways of work. And, and, you know, people just get to the point where they think that, you know, this is just this is life. This is what this is like what it is. This is there's nothing else outside of this, which is a damn lie. It's a fucking lie, man. You know what I'm saying? The Heavenly Father created the heavens and earth, and he going, as it says in Sirach, the, the, the Tim chapter, in due time, he's going to uh, set up over one, set up over it one that is profitable. And that's our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, man. The Heavenly Father going to set Yahweh Shai over this thing. So, yeah, man, I, I just was thinking about that. I was tripping off of that video, and then you can see how that they did that experiment on the people. And these people have invisible boundaries on them that they don't even realize is there. But the Lord, through his grace and mercy, has set us free. And now we fighting against that this big ass experiment. But hey, man, through the spirit power, y'all about Shemel Shai. I want to give all praises to y'all about Shemel Shai. Your brothers and sisters, stay strong out there. Shalom.